just gonna stop moving here so this guy doesn't see me. Oh. He knew. Get him. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. Do you prefer aggro jungling or scaling? Well, I prefer playing aggressive and, and being an early game jungler. So I think that's that's generally what I find the most fun and also what I consider myself best at. Doesn't mean I can't play in you know a, a Sejuani game or another chill champ like Ivan or, or something like this once in a while. But generally, you know, playing aggressive and playing early game junglers is what what I like the most. What did you have for dinner, Broxa? Why is... what? That's such a r random question, like... Why is this guy focusing on what I'm having for dinner and not focusing on the game? Well, what did you have? Lasagna? You know... To be honest... Okay, I'm gonna tell you guys what I had for dinner, you know, since some of you are actually curious. And I'm not even joking, I actually had lasagna for dinner. Like, imagine, our cook made lasagna for dinner for us today. So, if you, you know, have the feeling that my mechanics are a little more smooth than usual, if my gameplay is absolutely top-notch, absolutely on point, then it's because of the lasagna. You know, whenever I eat lasagna, you know, it, it gives me superpowers. So, I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Hopefully these two guys can push in the wave. Oops, that was a close one, actually. Maybe I can kill him. Oh, he ran out of the tower. Oh, that's really bad. I thought he ran up here and tried to escape. Now I don't have repel for the dive. Put an Israel. Oh, I'm gonna have to flash since I don't have my repel. Run! Yeah. That was not ideal. This guy is TP as well. Okay, if I actually had my repel, like, maybe one of them would still have died, but not both. So, kinda sucks. Shouldn't have wasted my repel. Should not have wasted it, that's for sure. Try to get a lead for us in the early game. I won't be able to finish off that guy. Dead. I look pretty dead. Okay, I guess that's too good at the game. That sucks. Okay, I can try to look mid here. Hopefully this is not wanted. Oh! The combo! Cocoon into... 6 ult. Rexa is mid so should be free. I don't think we have enough to kill this guy as well though. Oh, actually, maybe. Yeah. Nice! Got a kill on Draven too. Just gonna stop moving here so this guy doesn't see me. Oh. He knew. Get him. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. No! Are you kidding me? Close. I guess he did spot me. Well, we got a kill, so I'll take it. So after so much damage, I guess I'm flashing. This guy is really good. I'm running for my life. Fuck! No! Come on! Come on! Actually, here. Need to make it fast. Oh god, Raven is tanking us off. What? 
This is so fierce as well. Wait, what? Wait, you guys see this? The enemy team has slain the Infernal Drake. One minute after this... What? What? What happened? I mean, it doesn't even say they haven't... I have an Infernal, how is this possible? What a bug. What a weird bug. Weird, weird bug. Okay, I'm dead. Bye bye. <laughs> it's really not playable. It's really unplayable. They're way too fit. Oh well, rather Rexa is too fit. Rexa is flashed at least. Not something. Nice steal. Good steal, good steal. Get him. Nice. Uh. I might be in trouble. I guess I'm fine. Or what? Am I? Come on, 20 HP. I hope that kills him. It did not kill him. Oh gosh, Red Buff is not up. Oof, close enough. This guy is just pushing on the own. What is this damage? There's so much damage. Oh, it's when Drake dies, it says <laughs> enemy team is laying in front of Drake. Let's see. Oh, what? Oh, Seraph got me. God damn it, I should have ran. I didn't know Seraph was around as well. If I knew, it would probably just have ran for my life. Stop it. They have smites. Oh my god. Why did they finish, Baron? They got it so low, and then Rex just flashes in to secure them again. That would be so great if they did not. Give away the burn for enemy team. Oh well. Rek'Sai has a ton of damage, but he's super squishy. Like Draven can actually kill him in free autos or something. Mm. Rek'Sai. Gonna base. Get him. Oh, Draven is quite a monster. Like imagine if at one point they kill Draven and get him with with the Molly Wolf. Like that would like <laughs> that would be so bad. That reminds me of like. In season one and season two, you know, some people actually did this strat. I mean, no one obviously did it in rank. It would be like, kind of, you know, when you were playing with friends in a normal game or something, you would do the, like, you would do the feed the AD carry strategy with Mordecai. So you would feed the enemy AD carry, and then in late game you would just jump him and kill him and take him as the Mordecai clone. And you would have to really fed enemy AD carry, and you know, the AD would just be one shooting everyone on the enemy team. <laughs> I actually remember some people did this back in back in the good old days. I even saw it happening a few times. I mean, obviously, you know, it also happened sometimes where it wasn't on purpose and you were just, um, 
like the, the enemy AD carry would have like 20 kills and you would randomly, you know, get him, one shot him in a fight and get him as the more the guys are cloned and the AD carry would just pentakill the whole, uh, the whole enemy team. We're really fast. That Rexley won't even be able to get near before this Baron has been taken. I couldn't even smite because Draven's auto did like 800 damage. It feels as much as my smite. Oh, trying to peel the Draven. Keep the Draven alive. Oh no! Oh! Uh. Oh, this guy's less than me. Run, guys! Save the Baron. Actually. If this guy dies, they actually end. Wait, I didn't realize I have a mid wave. Oh, this might be really, really bad. Like, they might actually end. Please, space. If you die, my friend, we are doomed. Really? Is this a joke or what? I don't think we made it. I think we actually lost the game. Come on. Unbelievable. Oh. Why didn't 6 just pace? Like, come on. This game was so won. What on earth?